Everton made the decision to sack Frank Lampard as their manager after their defeat this past weekend against West Ham in the Premier League. The Toffees are of course in a relegation battle and are currently sat 19th in the table and 2 points from safety. Who should Everton hire to be their next boss? We have picked 5 potential candidates. The former Burnley manager Sean Dyche has been out of the game for nearly a year now but has got the experience of a relegation battle that Everton need. His football is, at best, functional, but Everton may just need that functionality right now as they struggle to score and keep the ball out of their own net. Dyche may be a boring move for the Everton fans, but there is no doubt that he has the tools to potentially keep them up. Probably a lazy link, Wayne Rooney will always be a potential candidate because of his history with Everton. Currently managing in the MLS with DC United, Rooney forged a managerial reputation at Derby where he nearly kept them up in the championship despite their financial woes and points deduction. Is he ready for a job like Everton? Probably not, but he may be able to galvanise the players for the run-in. Another functional manager in the mould of Sean Dyche, Nuno Espirito Santo left Spurs last season after failing to impress. The job he did at Wolves though prior to that was excellent as he got them promoted to the Premier League and helped them finish in the European places. Nuno could definitely be a long term answer to Everton's problems but we don't think he is the right man for the relegation dogfight. Ange Postagulu, the Celtic boss, has been a revelation since arriving in Glasgow and may have earned himself a move to the Premier League. Would he swap potential trophies in Champions League football for Everton though? It would seem unlikely. But the glitz and glamour of the Premier League may be too much for him to turn down. This would be a very interesting move for the Toffees. Duncan Ferguson would represent an appointment that would definitely send some shock raves around the Everton training ground and he would definitely make sure that the Everton players were giving 100% if he was boss. Unfortunately though, his experience is limited as he has never managed anywhere and you would worry about whether passion and pride would be enough to turn around Everton's fortunes.